Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to do these really cool mock-ups. They're a really cool way of presenting your designs and I suppose this kind of relates to the last tutorial I did where I kind of show you how to um, present your social media designs. So now I'm basically showing you how to make, how to present your advertisement designs in basically a public view, a realistic view. And uh, yeah, it looks really cool and it, it's really easy to do. It's really, it's actually really simple. So uh, first off, what we're going to be doing is we're going to go to Google and this is where you can find your picture of where your mock-up is going to be placed. So for this tutorial I chose a billboard so all I literally did is type in billboard you can type in bus stop like I did for this well no it's not bus stop uh, but you can do bus stop advertisements you can just do signage like this one and uh, yeah so um, you can just go to Google find some of those and um, yeah so just download it it doesn't matter if there's already a design on there um, but uh, yeah so what I can do is now I go to uh, Photoshop I just open it and then so once you've opened it you'll have this view and uh, now it's actually really simple. So what you want to start off by doing is getting your rectangle and then you just want to kind of just draw out a rectangle, kind of that simple. And uh, you, want to, you want to make sure that there's no stroke but and the, the color does not matter at all. But um, I'm just gonna have a red one just because it's really easy to see that way. Okay, so now we've drawn out our rectangle, you want to right click on the layer, then go to convert to smart object. And um, now what we can do is we can go to edit, transform, perspective, um, no, sorry, not perspective. We edit, transform, and distort. And now we can just basically match all the ends. So even if you're not doing a billboard, you just need to match all the ends, just like I'm doing here. Um, so yeah, let's just do that real quick. So now once we've done that, we can just press enter on our keyboard. And then when we show and hide the rectangle that we made, it should look exactly the same, just different color. And uh, like I said before, it doesn't matter if you, there's already a design on the board, on the billboard. So if I wanted, I could have used this one if I liked. Um, but uh, yeah, with this one, there isn't much perspective in it, so that's why I wanted to show you the distort thing. And uh, yeah, so now we've got this rectangle, and um, now we're going to do is we're going to double click on the thumbnail, and um, that will bring us to this new screen or new document kind of where we can edit the smart object. So now what we're going to do is we're going to open our advertisement or whatever we want to be placed. And we're just going to click and drag it in just like that and now we can press command t and just drag it out just so it fills the whole area so let's just do that okay that's good now what we're going to do is we're going to click on the x and then make sure we press save or there's nothing will happen and now whenever we go to our original object you can see that our advertisement has replaced the red rectangle that we had there before and uh, yeah you can see it looks really realistic it looks really cool and um, if you can, if you can, you can keep editing that as well if you like. So you can just double click, double click on the thumbnail, of the layer again, and you can see we've got a red rectangle here again. If we wanted to, to put on another design, we could just add it on top of this advertisement. So just click on the eye, then uh, press on the, the X, press save again, and then go to our original project, and there you can see that it just changes. And yeah, that's a really cool way of presenting your designs, and uh, you can post them on Twitter, and yeah, it looks really cool that way. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you found it helpful, don't forget to, to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video.